you know, everything happens for a reason. You know, it's all made us stronger. And, you know, there's there's no career that is just absolutely perfect, you know, or yeah. it works out the way every, everyone wants it to. And, uh, you know, I've been blessed, you know, to pretty, for the most part, stay healthy. And, you know, you know, when my time, number's called, I got I lucked out last year, you know, Reed moving to offensive tackle, Jake moving to receiver, and Zach going to linebacker. I mean, shit, you know, I mean, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. I'm sitting there like, oh, uh, <laughs> who's up that? You know what I'm saying? Like, that's just, <laughs> I mean, it's not like I saw that coming, you know. Right. <laughs> but, uh, you know, that's what my dad always said, just work hard and you know things will work out in the end and you know that, that's what happened last year and you know that's what will happen I hopefully will happen the next few years. So. You think it was a good decision that you quit playing hockey then? Yeah, <laughs> definitely. I should make that decision because I wouldn't have needs right now. What happened? <laughs> uh, broke my leg playing. <sighs> Rough. Yeah, I'm an athlete, what can I tell you? <laughs> <laughs> right. At least you're doing something athletic, right? I was trying. I guess I learned I shouldn't, but I got uh, my buddy uh, Jack Campbell's coming next week. Yeah. For the he plays for Dallas now, and uh, so he's going. He'll come to practice next week. He's coming to Columbus for the next few days. So. Yeah, he was a Michigan recruit at one point, wasn't he? Yeah. Yeah. He ended up going uh, yeah. OHL somewhere, I think. Yeah, like I think Kitchener or something like that. Yeah. And he played. He was a he was a goalie for the uh, USA. Yeah, the world. Under 17 team, the yeah. world team or whatever. He was a boy there, and so yeah, he's a big Buckeye fan, so he'll be here next week. Really? Is that, is, then why did he commit to Michigan back in the day? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> he didn't help John Markle out. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> right. Well, they had another recruit, uh, John Gibson, who was a goalie of the two that was supposed to be coming in, and then Markle right. got let go, and the whole thing went to shit, as right. you would say. But, uh, <laughs> <laughs> right, right. What uh, uh, Urban's raved about you and Nick Vanette, just the tight ends mm -hmm. and, and all, and you guys bring kind of a different skill set to the table. I mean, just you personally just seeing everything out there. I mean, what do you think of that position? You know, between Nick and I, you know, I was, we, if you look at this offense, it's, it's almost pretty much impossible to run with just one tight end, um, especially with our jet tempos. And it's, it's the way it is with a lot of the skill positions, even our receivers, you know, we're going so fast that you got, you guys got to rotate guys in and, you know, get, yeah. get fresh guys in there. Cause I mean, as far as the tight end receiver position, running back position, you can't just play one guy. And uh, especially with this offense and our tempo and everything, and you know, Nick, between Nick and I, it, it works out great because we can, we both stay fresh and you know, stay healthy, and uh, you know, so it helps out a lot. You talked about the tempo there. I mean, there was a lot of talk last fall about you guys going fast, and then it just didn't really materialize. I think the way right. Urban wanted it to. Right. Is that going to change this year? I mean, you feel like you. Uh, I mean, I, th I think so. Uh, we've been working on a lot of, you know, going fast, and uh, so that's been a big part of the offseason, staying conditioned and stuff. So. You know, hopefully it'll turn out the way we want it to. So, you notice a different flair in camp this year, just knowing that a bowl game and national title is a possibility. Um, I wouldn't say a different flair. Um, I mean, camp is camp for the most part. Yeah. Uh, I think, I think we're more excited for the season this year than we were last year, uh, just because last year there's so many question marks. You know, we coming off that that year and the Gator Bowl loss and. Uh, new coaching staff, like what's going on? Are we going to be you know, this, that? And I think this year there's a lot more excitement going into the season than there was last year, just because there's not as many question marks. You know, you know how things are going to be, and uh, so I think that's a big difference. Urban just.